What's going on you guys? I am Mitchell with Mitchell's Lawn Care. Welcome here to the channel. Hope you guys are having a wonderful day. This video is going to be a little bit different than the past. Just going to sit here and, and talk to you guys for a few minutes about the new DeWalt Ascent Series mowers that I got to uh, see unveiled at the Equip Expo. Uh, I want to start off and say thank you to DeWalt for this opportunity. I partnered up with them for the 2022 Equip Expo uh, to help them uh, unveil these new mowers to you guys and I'm very excited about this opportunity. <music> All right, you guys, so like I said, I'm just gonna talk to you guys briefly uh, about these mowers, what I saw, some things I like. I can't wait to get on them. Um, I'm also gonna touch very briefly on the situation that happened out in the demo yard uh, that some of you guys may be aware of, okay? Wasn't gonna say anything about it, but I've had a lot of guys approach me about it and just gonna give you uh, my opinions on the matter, all right? First off, uh, DeWalt unveiled the C60 and the R60. This is their battery powered um, ride on, you know, either in a sit down format with the R60 or the combo sit down stand on mower with the C60. Um, just gonna throw up some images here, okay? Uh, but again, the, the R60 is their conventional style zero turn mower, uh, sit down only uh, with the battery pack um, power plant okay um, and uh, you know there's some things that I liked about both mowers okay they share a lot of similarities but anyways the the C60 was their combo stand on and sit down mower and some of you are probably thinking what in the world but uh, there is an option for you the operator to either sit down and operate this mower like a regular zero turn mower or if you feel like standing on a property, you can convert the mower over to a stand-on mower. And it got demoed, and it literally takes less than 30 seconds to convert from sit-down to stand-on, okay? I like how you can um, get on and off of the mower via the very front, okay? Um, there's a step right there that where you can walk up on the, the platform. You don't have to step on the mower deck if you don't want to. So there's an option to step on and off the mower. So if you're sitting down um, and you go to stand up, you literally just walk straight off. You don't have to step off to the left or right side. And, and then right there at the step uh, to get onto the mower at the front, DeWalt has um, outfitted these mowers with some LED lights. You know, pretty much headlights for... Uh, you know, or those early morning hours or those late evenings when, you know, the, the sun either hasn't come up yet uh, or it's uh, going down too soon and you're not done with your job yet. So I really like that they've incorporated the lights on the front of this. So many of you guys add auxiliary lights onto your mowers, um, you know, aftermarket. And this one has them incorporated into the mower, which I, I thought was uh, really, really nice to have those integrated in from the factory. And then right there. You've got uh, adjustable uh, foot rests based on your height and where you need to be at or what's comfortable for you. Um, you can adjust the foot rests either front and back depending on you know what is comfortable to you. So there's a lot of adjustability uh, with those foot rests and you know most you know sit down zero turn mowers that I have been on there's no uh, adjustability in the foot platform. You kind of just You've got what you got and that's it. So it's really neat to see the customization. Moving on up to the operator station, um, R60 and C60 in the sit down configuration. I really like how the intuitive controls and all that stuff are up on the right, you know, a little bit more visible instead of being down so low compared to some other brands that I've been on. Um, so I really like how the controls are up higher. Um, you know, you can see everything that's going on with the mower. Um, right there and the suspension seat is really nice. Uh, it looks like uh, Seats that I'm familiar with that I have been on before they're they're comfortable. You can adjust it to your weight um, So I like that they have gone with a, a really nice high quality seat for this moving on uh, up to again, we're, we're gonna focus on the c60 but the biggest thing about this mower is that 
it converts from stand on to a sit down, okay? And the controls are literally on a track. So they slide forward and they slide back. There's no like flipping over or nothing like that. So going to the stand up position from sit down, you'll fold your ROPS bar down and it's made to integrate into the back of the mower. Uh, so it folds down out of the way and then you just slide the controls back to you. Um, something that's neat about this is on a conventional zero turn mower like the C, uh, like the uh, R60, you have your, you know, what I would call like your lap bars, like your regular uh, controls, which is different than that of a stand on mower, um, which has the more hand controls, okay? So on the C60, if you're sitting down uh, operating the C60, you don't have those lap bars. You're, you're not really using your arms to control the mower. You're just using your hands like, you know, like your conventional stand on mower controls. Um, you know, so I thought that was really neat. When the mower is in the stand on configuration, uh, you've got a really good line of sight out the front of it. Um, it's a compact mower from front to back. The wheelbase is really short, even though it is a stand on um, and a sit down mower all in one. Uh, it's a pretty compact unit. The battery pack is right underneath the operator seat, um, tucked in out of the way, which is how DeWalt was able to make the stand on platform at the back for you to stand on. They, they did not spare on parts and components. Everything was beefy and commercial. And just the fit and finish of everything looked high quality. Uh, and I'm super excited about them for this mower, okay? So that's pretty much uh, highlights of the C6 that I like. Of course, it being the combo mower, I love the aspect of being able to switch from sit down to stand on. And some guys, you know, uh, that don't really understand it, I've tried to tell them, you know, you know, you may have a, a man or a woman that, you know, they can't stand all day or they can't sit all day or they have, you know, a mixture of properties. Like they've got some, you know, your smaller, more posted stamp yards where you're on and off the mower a lot and a stand on mower is perfect for that and then maybe they have a larger property in the day or the week where they would like to sit down now they have one mower they can do it all instead of having to have two another thing is um you know if you're on a property where you're having to pick up a lot of trash or sticks or whatever kind of debris and you're on and off the mower a lot a stand on's perfect for that um, a stand on's also um, safer in the event of an emergency or something where you need to get off the mower very quickly um, if you're in a standing position, it's a lot easier to, to get off the mower a lot quicker. So um, I like that, you know, you, you have the option. So you, you, nece you don't necessarily have to have two mowers. Now you only need one. You're cutting costs. You're meaning, you know, less maintenance and all that stuff. You don't have as many blades to take care of. Um, so it, it's a really, really, really cool product. I'm super excited about um, you know, getting some time on the C60 and I'm so happy for DeWalt and the Ascent series. I think they're just going to hit it out of the park. Okay. Now I want to take a couple minutes and talk about the situation that happened at Equip, uh, in the demo yard. Uh, one of their prototype demo mowers did, um, experience a, a failure. Um, the mower caught on fire. Okay. And it, it was all over the internet. Everybody was talking about it. Um, some folks were supportive, some folks not so supportive, which is expected, okay? Is it a black eye for the company? Yes, okay. Do I hate that it happened? Of course, I wouldn't want it to happen to anybody. Um, but I, I left there with the feeling and the notion that if this was going to happen to anybody, DeWalt, in my opinion, is, you know, a leader in battery technology and they are going to figure out one why it happened how it happened and two what they need to do so it never happens again um, you know a lot of people were not aware that these were you know prototype demo test however you want to say it mowers and they weren't production units unfortunately the mower experienced a failure i don't know what happened i'm not dewalt so uh, it, it's not my place to know the ins and outs of exactly what happened but since i was partnered up with with them for the for the show and and other videos here on the channel you know i, I felt the need to say something because i, I believe in the brand I mean, there's stuff's here behind me. I've been using DeWalt tools since I was a kid and as long as I can remember. Um, so I support the brand through and through. 
and they're going to be okay. They're going to come out of this stronger than ever, and I, I cannot wait to see when these mowers come to production because they're going to hit a home run. So, you know, am I asking you to be supportive? No, I'm not asking you to do anything, but maybe be respectful of the fact that these things happen. Nobody was hurt. Um, and again, I will reiterate the fact that if anybody can prevail from this, in my opinion, DeWalt um, is the brand to do so because they're a leader in battery technology, in my opinion. So um, I appreciate everything they've done for me lately. Um, they are sponsors of, of this video uh, and my, my trip to Equip Expo, and I'm most excited about them. Uh, bringing this product lineup to market. The Ascent series is going to be great for you guys. And if you're into battery powered mowers and it's something that you are excited about, then you're going to be excited about the C60 and the R60. So if you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up, smash that subscribe button. If you've got any questions, comments, concerns, leave them down in the comment section down below. And I hope to maybe one day soon, bring the C60 here to the channel and get some time on it to show you guys how that thing works, show you how it mows. Um, I, I can't say enough how much I am excited about that mower. Uh, I've not been excited about many battery powered mowers, but I am very, very excited about that combo mower from DeWalt. So anyways, thanks again to DeWalt uh, for the brand partnership and uh, supporting me and this channel um, and bringing this content to you guys. So we'll see you next video.